Hi everybody, it's Saturday. Happy Diwali to those of you that are celebrating today. It's the Festival of the Lights. And um, I finally got my video loaded last night. I was so happy. I couldn't believe it. I kid you not. I did try like a hundred times. And um, I have other videos that I don't think they're ever going to load. So, delete. They go into the not uploaded folder. But... I've got to do something. I've got to burn my videos because um, my space and my hard drive is quickly getting eaten up by YouTube videos. Bad, bad iffy. Anyway, but um, past couple of days I haven't felt too well. And um, it's just part of my sickness where I get really dizzy and ugh, it was horrible. And um, so today I feel alive and it's amazing what a shower can do for someone. I mean, not that I don't shower on a regular basis, but I felt so cruddy yesterday. The shower wasn't happening, but it happened today, and I feel much, much better for it. So I hope everybody's having a great Saturday. Um, I'm getting ready to go shopping. I love it. And, um, oh, look, this is for Beth if she sees it. I'm wearing my hooker hoots, hoops today. I didn't feel like I usually match everything, so if I'm wearing my Tiffany choker, I wear the matching earrings that go with it. And um, I always wear my my bracelet. You guys can't see that, but I have a matching bracelet and ring. Like I said, I buy things in sets. But today was more, the shirt's kind of Parisian, and I felt that it was appropriate for hooker hoops. Anyway, oh, and another little shout out to Beth. Your F-bomb video killed me, and, you know, I thank you for the description of a holly. <laughs> I know what that is. I've been enough times that I know what a holly is. Interestingly, though, when I go with my fiancé, which is every time, um, <clears throat> when I'm by myself and, you know, he's off doing something or whatever, I get treated a little bit differently and not in the friendliest manner. And this isn't saying it for everybody, you know, for, for all the people on the islands that are, well, I know what you're talking about when you say that there are locals that say that they're Hawaiian trust me um but when I'm with him people don't know what to make of him because he doesn't look like a typical East Indian and sometimes he gets he, he can pass himself off as being Hispanic or um or an islander now his family is from Fiji his parents were born and raised there but like a Hawaiian they don't consider themselves Fijian they're Indian and um, so I know a little bit about that too but I just died that this person called you a holly girl talk about rubbing your ass the wrong way holy cow oh, anyway but um, no I thought that was really funny and uh, made my day on a day I didn't feel very good and I'm still catching up on y'all's videos from ST3 and um, I get about halfway through them and besides the conversion that YouTube did which is just, I think, kind of affected everybody. Um, my connection hasn't been the greatest either. So, and I'm, I've said it before, I'm Wi-Fi here. And um, it's kind of included in my rent, so I get what I get. I could break down and call Comcast and say, hey, I want internet. Why? <laughs> Text message. <laughs> I guess that's my cue. Let's see. I think that's my cue that we're going to be leaving for shopping soon. And, um, yep, heading to your place. All right. That's good stuff. I like to shop. We're not shopping, shopping. We're, like, picking up a little few things. He's hungry. And, oh, before I go, I did want to tell you guys, I had more drunk dialing last night. No, not by me, obviously. But um, in the midst of me not feeling well, and I'm telling you, I slept, uh, not, I mean, it was sporadic, but man, I slept. I didn't wake up today until about 4 o'clock. Now, I woke up, and then I fell asleep, and then I woke up, and then I fell asleep again, but ugh, it was horrible. And then you add drunk dialing on top of it, and I got a text message at 10.30 last night that said, I'm going to bed. Then I got the drunk dial at 12.30, and I tried to get myself out of that one, and it just wasn't happening. And then I woke up to another 
message today where my indicator, I've got to shut it off or something. But it woke me up. And don't you know, I don't know if my fiancé is sending my resume out to um, just all these different Craigslist and they don't really identify what their jobs really are. But if I get one more email saying, yes, we've received your application and we would like you to work for our company in New Zealand or in the UK or blah, 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 need I go on? Okay, I've been a legal assistant for 15 years, okay? Before that, I worked in insurance. And before that, I worked as a medical transcriptionist. I got the transcribing part down, trust me. You throw me an accent and I can transcribe it. I'll tell you what. But anyway, I got one this morning. It really pissed me off because I was so tired and I was having such a rough night sleeping. And then I find out that I can't even pronounce his name. Moon Cho Cho had sent me a message, you know, from New Zealand. Thanks. The commute's a little long, buddy. <laughs> anyway, all right, you guys. I'm going to go and go shopping. I might be back. We'll see. Depends on what kind of stuff I get. All right. Take care. Bye.